Many news stories raise ethical questions, and the New York Times has a magazine column dedicated to exploring the ethics of daily life. The column is called The Ethicist, and people write in for advice on the ethics of a particular situation. The following selection is from February 7th, 2005. <clears throat> for a number of years, my eighth grade son has been on the basketball team of his small private school. This year, rather than sports, he decided to take up other social activities like music and pursuing girls. <clears throat> Various parents have called us asking if he was going to play. If he doesn't, there will be no boys team. Is it ethical to pressure a child by asking his parents if he will serve Steve, Steve Gleckham, Bethlehem, Pennsylvania? Randy Cohen's response. <clears throat> it would be wrong to intimidate a child into playing basketball. Few ethicists would endorse having the ghost of James Nasmith make your son an offer he can't refuse. But there's nothing untoward in their encouraging your son to re-enlist or in their lobbying his parents to that end. And while it may be impossible to delineate precisely when reasonable persuasion becomes unacceptable pressure, a few inquiring phone calls seem well within the bounds of civility. Playing school sports is voluntary, of course, no matter, not a matter of academic duty. If there is insufficient interest among the students to feel the team, so be it. That's not the fault of your son. Rather than badgering, badger him into donning sneakers and shorts, the school would do better to bully all the kids who aren't playing. No, wait, that can't be right. The school would do better to make basketball appealing to all those kids who have never gone out for the team. A case might be made against a key player quitting a team mid-season. There, he might have obligations to his teammates, but your son has no duty to join the team. And after all, he's at a stage of life when you're supposed to try out diverse activities, among which pursuing romance and music are two time-tested ones for adolescents. <clears throat>